I just killed one yesterday, and he killed one last weekend. Oh, so I, I got four in the freezer from last year. I don't have any from last year. Well, I got five for this year. So I had a bigger freezer. Yeah. That thing got a good pattern on it, I'll tell you that. Yeah. Let me go get the truck. I'll back it up down. Well, I see him coming down the line. And I didn't want to shoot at first because I would be shooting down the line. And actually, he was coming behind me down the edge of the river. He was about 30 yards off the riverbank. You sure? Yeah. He's going to bring the truck on that. Ain't no need doing all that if I can drag it a little bit further. Let him back it up right here instead of going through all that crap. Yeah. But yeah, that thing, how far away was it when you shot it? Uh, 30 yards or so. That's a tight pattern. For okay. sure. I heard the shot. And I turned, I got myself spun around and aimed in the right direction. And he come right on down. I said, okay, here he comes. And I was, it looked like I was behind a bunch of bullshit. I'm sure you like could hear him pretty good. Oh, yeah. I was behind a bunch of bullshit like this. And I let him come right on out. And I, boom, he rolled his ass. And the second shot, I shot over him. He was trying to get up. And as soon as I shot, he just dropped on down. I said, well, I ain't shooting him a third time, wasting a $4 bullet. Somebody else killed a nice buck. Yeah. I don't know if William was talking about this buck coming into the drive or, or if he was talking about the one he shot. I don't even know. I just kind of lost track, turned the radio down because that shot was real close to me. I said, oh, no. Nah. We got the people coming to pick the dogs up right here. Yeah, good. good. Hey, who's down here on, uh, at the washout? Bam good. Um, 